Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Mel Holistic. I am Mel, short form for Melissa. Well, today I am in Singapore Botanical Gardens. Look around me. So much lush, so much greenery, it's beautiful. I just came back from Bali yesterday and today I feel like basking myself in nature. And me together, let's do a short yoga sequence to flow with me, get ready for the morning and basically just feel good. Bask yourself in the nature here. Get yourself comfortable in the mat, get a block or two, and let's begin. Now let us come to sit in comfortable seated position. Back upright, shoulders away from the ears, crown of the head high up towards the ceiling. And gently close your eyes, hands on your knees. And now listen to the sound of the inhalation and exhalation. As you inhale, let your abdomen bulge up. As you exhale, slowly pull your belly button in towards your back. Continue to inhale. Exhale. One more time, inhale. Exhale. Now gently open up your eyes. As you inhale, raise your hands up, interlock your fingers together, palms facing towards the sky, shoulders away from your ears, biceps behind your ears. Inhale, look up, chin up, and continue to pull your hand behind your ears. And as you exhale, release your hands, interlock your fingers behind your back, and open up your chest as you inhale, squeezing your shoulder blades together. And release, look forward. Good. Now let's come to all fours. Now, shoulders stack above your wrists and knees stack to below your hips. As we are coming into cat and cow, inhale, arch your back. Look up, chin up. Coming into cow pose. Exhale, round your back, pushing your back high up towards the sky into cat pose. One more time, inhale. Exhale, round your back. One more time, inhale. Exhale. Good. Coming back to neutral back. Good. Now curl your toes and push your hips back, coming into downward facing dog. Now let's walk the dog. So first, straighten your right knee, bend your left knee. Try to ground your right heel into the mat and we switch sides. Bending your right knee, straighten your left knee and ground your left heel onto the mat and we keep alternating our knees to loosen up any tight hamstrings, tight calf muscles. Continue to lengthen your back, push your weight into your palm and turn fingers and whenever you're ready, join me in downward facing dog. Any lower back pain, you can push your heels slightly away from the mat. If not, try to ground your heels onto the mat, looking into your toes. Good. Now looking at the space in between your palms, right foot step forward in between your palms. Left knee on the mat, left toes flat, raising your hands up, slight back bend. And exhale, palms back onto the mat. Left foot, step forward in between your palms. Good. And just come into forward fold, grabbing onto the opposite ends of your elbow. Let it hang. Good. Lower your hands down. Now this time around, right foot step back. Right knee on the mat, right toes flat. Inhale, slight back bend, raising your hands up. Exhale, hands forward. Right foot step forward. Coming to forward for one more time. Grabbing the opposite ends of your elbows. And just shake your body from left to right, left to right. Now, coming into chair pose, so sit your hips low, hands high up, knees do not cross your toes. Imagine you're sitting on a chair. Inhale, hands up, slight back bend. 
Exhale, palms together in front of your heart center. Good. Now stepping your right foot back, coming into high lunge, right heel off the mat, left knee bent 90 degrees, right knee straight, right leg straightened. Good. Now flatten your right toes and toes turn 45 degrees out. Now interlock your fingers behind your back. Open up your chest, coming into humble warrior. Inhale, chest up. Exhale, bend your head forward. Now for beginners, you can choose to stay here for intermediate or advanced. You can follow me to so place your forehead on the mat if you can. And pull your arms higher away from your back. Breathing in and out. And out. And head up. Straighten out your left knee. Hands on your hips. Now right foot step slightly forward. Inhale, straighten up your hands. Good. Exhale, bend forward from your hips. And your hands, you can either place it on a block under each hand or just be on your fingertips or your palms. Inhale, chest up. Exhale, bend forward. Now you should feel the stretch in your left hamstring. Both knees are straightened. Just enjoy the moment. Good. Inhale, head up. Exhale, hands on your hips. Right foot step forward. And now we switch legs. Left foot step back coming into a high lunge hands up right knee bend 90 degrees left heel up good just stay for a moment here now hands on your hips straighten your right knee left foot step slightly forward straightening both knees inhale hands up exhale bend forward and Try to place your forehead closer towards your right knee. Continue to inhale and exhale. Hands up, hands on your hips. Now bending your right knee, interlock your fingers together. Opening up your chest. Bending your body forward into humble warrior. Continue to inhale and exhale. One more breath in, one breath out and head up, hands on your hips and now left foot step forward. And now just take a moment here, palms together in front of your heart centre, breathing in and out. Now release your hands, palms facing forward into mountain pose, lift up your kneecap. Tighten your thighs, squeeze your glutes together, pull your back upright, shoulders away from your ears, corner of the head high up towards the ceiling. Then just take a moment here, breathing in and out. You can choose to close your eyes if you want to. Immerse yourself in the beautiful surroundings. Enjoy the music. Enjoy the nature. Go ahead and slowly open up your eyes and look forward. Good. Now come to sit onto the mat and separate your legs wide to your maximum. Now if it's too strenuous and too painful for you, you can close up the gap. So it depends on which is comfortable for you. And now let's stretch over to your right. Open up your chest. And we switch sides. Stretch over towards your left this time round. Open up your chest and let it hunch. Good. One more time to your right. 
And now to your left. Feel the opening of your inner thighs. Yeah. And now we come up. Now let's lie on the mat. Take a moment here to enjoy the beautiful nature around me. And rest for a moment here. Good. Now bending both knees. Now can you stack your right foot over your left knee and grab onto the back of your left thigh, pulling your leg closer towards your body. Feel the opening and stretch of your right glutes in figure four. Good, now straighten your left knee. See if you can grab onto your left ankle or your left toes. Your stretch. And release. We switch legs. Stack your left foot over your right knee and grab to the back of your right thigh and pull your legs closer towards your chest. Now feel the stretch opening of your left glutes this time round. And now straighten your right knee, grab onto your right ankle or your right toe. Good. Now we release. And bending both legs. Now you can choose to follow me to do a shoulder stand. If not, just remain in bridge pose like this, squeezing your glutes, lifting your pelvis high up. If you can, let's follow me to straighten your knees first. Lift your hips slightly using your hands to support your glutes and slowly lift up your legs into shoulder stand just let the blood flow towards your head breathing in and out and now slowly lower your legs and knees closer towards your head hands supporting your lower back and slowly roll your glutes down with your legs close to your face and slowly lower your legs down coming into shavasana Supporting your legs, the opposite side of the mat, arms facing up, breathing in and out. Let your body be heavy, let it sink into the earth. Take a moment here. You can actually continue in Shavasana for 10 to 15 minutes to remove any body fatigue you may be feeling. But of course, for this video, we will just do a short Shavasana. But in your own practice, feel free to rest in Shavasana for as long as 15 minutes or longer if you need. Now, whenever you're ready, wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingertips, stretch your hands above your head, feet together. Give your body a good stretch in opposite direction. And good. Hug your knees to your chest. Good. And slowly roll yourself up. Come to sit. Like how we started the class. Back upright and inhale. Raise your hands up. Foster exhalation, hands down. One more time. Inhale, hands up. Foster exhalation, hands down. Oh, the wind is blowing here. It's beautiful weather. Inhale, hands up. Exhale, hands down. And now, palms together in front of your heart center. Take a moment here. Listen to the breeze. Thank you for joining me in this class. Thank you for your effort. I hope you liked what I have shared taught you today. Now gently bow to yourself. Namaste and open up your eyes. And hope you like what I have shared today. If you have enjoyed what I have taught you today, give me a thumbs up like. Give me your comments. What are the videos that you would like me to do for you? What are the questions you may have? And remember to subscribe for more updates 
as I'll be sharing more of such yoga sequence, nuggets of wisdom every day. And hope to see you around in my next video. Take care. Bye-bye.